likely be helping with the search? Our Michael Martin shows us how a train company in West Olive has figured out how to do just that. Just about anything you can think of we can do for dogs. The possibilities are endless, according to Stephen Perrin, owner of West Michigan Canine. From everything from training a dog to pull their kids in a sled to getting a beer out of the refrigerator to um, uh, keeping kids from drowning in the pool. While the company works mostly with law enforcement and military dogs, two years ago, a friend with the Muskegon Mushroom Hunters came to Stephen with a question. Could you teach a dog to find morel mushrooms? And I said, let's find out. And so I grabbed my personal dog Zeus out of the house and um, we had had some mushrooms in the house already in the freezer and we pulled them out, we imprinted them on it and then seemed to work. This is video of Zeus on his first search for the elusive morel. At the time, the team's still unsure if he'd be able to zero in on the set in the wild. As soon as we let him out, we gave him the command. He, and within 10 minutes or so, he, he found everything. There's one cut off right there. Look at that. Unbelievable. It was just mind blowing because we actually thought he got one wrong. He, you know, he gave that final response, and my wife was sitting there digging in the leaves. Oh, oh my God, is this one? Nah, shriveled up. Yeah, beach nut. Oh no, it's the, it's the, it's the, it's the uh, and I knew we were on to something. And so since then, it just hasn't stopped. Now, for the first time, West Michigan Canine is offering sessions to train your dog to do the same. So this is just what we call a scent board. She'll essentially take the target odor and put it in one of the holes. The scent is imprinted onto the dog using this scent board. Once familiar, the training will move outdoors. All right, so I'm put Philip in search mode. I Philip. Search. Once they find a morel, the dogs are taught to point and be still so they don't damage the mushroom. He's definitely got a mushroom right here. Good job, good job, Philip. In West Olive, Michael Martin, Fox 17 News.